Hey Simmers, it's Cameo here with another episode of The Sims 4 Vampire Family Challenge. Jess became a vampire in the last episode. Um, she's losing a bit of fun here. She's a fledging vampire. Um, and I think, oh, we do have two power points. So we could get bat form, cast hallucinations or eternally welcome. I think we might do eternally welcome. I'm kind of wanting her, oh no, we'll do a cult student actually. So she'll move up to a cult disciple. So she'll lose, use less vampire energy. Through study and practice, Jess has reduced the amount of vampiric energy needed to fuel her powers. Continued study will yield even greater efficiency. That sounds good to me. So I'll take that one. Um, so we're sort of wanting to level her up and just kind of see how she goes adjusting to life as a vampire. So she does need her fun to go up a little bit. So I think I'm not sure if playing on the piano or the organ helps, but we might get her to come and maybe practice a bit of piano over here. And let's find out what the others are doing. Brayden, oh, are we not surprised? Why am I not surprised that he is working out? He's always working out seriously. And he still hasn't read Encyclopedia Volume 1. I really do want him to um, move up in his skill level with it. So I'm going to get him to come down here to the library. We're going to open and hopefully we'll find, yeah, here we go. Encyclopedia Vampires Volume 1. We'll get him to read that. Amy, well, I don't know what she's doing. What's she doing? Oh, she's chatting. Okay, that's fine. Um, Rain, what are you up to? Hanging out in Amy's bathroom. That looks like fun. Let's find out what's going on with his Okay, so he needs to don't drink deeply for five days in a row. Okay, so we won't get him to do any deep drinking from Sims. Um, that, that looks like a pretty easy one to do. What I might get him to do, because we've still got the vampire pets around, is come down here. Oh, she's been drunk from? Okay. Um, what about Alice over here? Vampire, drink plasma, compel for a small drink. That works for me. What's Camille doing? Camille, what are you up to? She wants to introduce herself to, here you go, you can introduce yourself to, what's your name? What's your name? Well, don't run away. Laura, you can come introduce yourself to Laura Lush. So Brayden actually has a bit of a romantic relationship with her. She's more like his plaything than anything else. But I think she looks really cute in this outfit. Nice, nice and gothic, pretty traditional for what you think when people get dressed up for hanging out with vampires. <laughs> she's, she's pretty cool, I actually really like her. We were, I'm debating whether or not I turn her into a vampire after Jess, but I, I don't think Brayden would want a love interest hanging around for the rest of his life. He doesn't really strike me like that person. Okay, Leah needs to de defeat three vampires in combat. Um, oh, Rain is a prime, oh, he's a prime vampire. Oh, hello. He's having his drink here. Looks a little vampiric, a little scary in that form. Oh, he's turning back. Back to normal. Okay. Um, let's find out because I think we can pick some more points now that he's leveled up. Yeah, we've got three. So he's a prime vampire and he's moving towards a master vampire. So let's see, we've got three points. We can do vampire creation, command, mm, no, vampiric strength, yeah, um, I think we're going to hang on to these points. Oh, he's got to take a weakness as well. Okay, we might actually go for Vampiric Strength. And Sloppy Drinker, no. Rest Sleep of the Undead, no. We might go... Do we want to do a Withered Stomach? I'm not sure. Definitely not Uncontrollable Hissing. Maybe Thin Skinned? No. I tell you what, we're, we're going to pick Withered Stomach. I was kind of hoping he'd eat normal human food, but that's just not going to happen for him because I had to pick something. He's having a bit of a read. Why is he tense? Oh no, guilty drinker. I keep forgetting. Look at it. Tense plus 50. Feeding off the living gives rain a bad feeling, but being thirsty seems to be worse for him. Guilty drinker for hours. Oh my gosh. Um, what can we do to ease his tension? Um, do you reckon we can like maybe do a bubble bath or something? Is that weird if a vampire has a bubble bath? Yeah, here, well, he can take a bath to calm down. That, that sounds good. Now, what's going on with Jess? Um, I want her to be a good vampire, so we're just going to select that one for her. I think it's under 
Um, it's not under family. I think it's under like the popularity. Is it popularity or something? Let's find out. Dot dot popularity. Yeah, good vampire. So we're going to accept that one for her. Use a computer to search for information on vampires. So yeah, I really want her to aspire to be a good vampire. So we're going to come here. What have we achieved? Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Maxis, for those random little bits of information. More vampire secrets. Um, search for information on vampires. Okay, I'm just going to get Amy to move away from the computer so you can come sit here. So we're going to get Jess to look for information on vampires. Oh, game had a bit of a freak out there. I might get you to end the gathering, Amy. We'll send home all these little vampire pets. Bye bye, go home, see you later. Okay, so Jess is doing that research. She needs to drink a plasma pack, make five friends, and don't drink deeply for five days in a row. So that's kind of like the same thing Rain's got going on at the moment, I think. Yep, he's having his bath. Okay, Jess, have we done our reach vampire level four? No, she's already done that. Drink a plasma pack, has she got? A plasma pack, yeah, so we'll get her to drink that. No, oh, Brayden and Camilla are showing off their powers. Okay, fair enough, guys. Rah, I am stronger. I am stronger. Okay, no, I'm gonna get uh, Leah to come over here and have a spa with Brayden because I don't think she's beaten him yet. And she needs to defeat one more vampire for her aspiration master vampire to move up to the third tier. So we'll see how that goes. I think Brayden, what tier is he on? So he's still on the first tier. So we'll get him to do that. Oop, they're disappearing. Where are they going? Where are you guys going? Oh, they're going outside. Okay. <laughs> bam, bam, pow. I love this vampire spa so much. It's so cool. Oh, I think she's losing. She's losing. Dang. Oh, dear. I think she needs... Can we get her more points? She's got two. That's not enough for strength, I don't think. Nope, she needs another one. Okay. Well, we'll get there. Oh, uh, yes. He beat her. <sighs> she's just not catching a break, is she? Because she's faced Camille, I think. Has she... I think she's beaten Jess. I'm just going to... Ooh, whoops. I'm just going to get her to click on Rain. And we'll see if maybe she hasn't beaten Rain yet. So we'll go more. Um, it's under friendly. I don't know why they put it there and not under vampire. It seems more of a vampiric thing to do. But anyway. Where are you, Brayden? You're having a shower. Okay, buddy. You can have a shower. I think he bat formed up here. <laughs> I'm really wanting Jess to have um, either the mist form or uh, the fast running. What's it called? Like supernatural speed. Um, but she has to be on level four four I think for that one or level five so we're going to be waiting for that before she moves quickly maybe Camille and Jess can have a bit of vampire how about you introduce yourself and we'll see how these two go hey you know I don't really like you um but you know well you know being a vampire sucks a bit so we might get her to vampire offer training no I don't feel like she'd be that friendly uh, discuss plasma flavors, recall mortal life. Yeah, let's get her to do that. Kind of reminisce a bit about the life she left behind to become a vampire. That looks good. Yeah, oh, I love her teeth. She looks so cool. I really like the kind of style I went for with these vampires. She's having a chat. They're getting along. I kind of didn't want these two to get along, but they seem like good friends. So we're making it work. Jess is a bit like, oh no, <laughs> look at her. She looks so cool as a vampire, I reckon. Look at those teeth. Wow. She looks a little too innocent still. Might dye her hair black or something. I'm not sure. Did that... No, did she end up versing Rain? I don't think they did. Where's Rain? I can't click on him for some reason. What's going on? Where are you? Come back. Come here and spar against your master i think it is our master actually master and offspring vampiric spa okay let's try this again shall we come on make it work guys i seriously love leah's outfit so much if you hear me sniffling i am a little bit sick at the moment i've just been down in sydney and it was such an amazing time down there um 
they had a few gaming conventions and things like that so i was down there experiencing that and being a part of it james turner was there a couple of other really prominent youtubers were there as well it was a really fantastic fun time there was streaming um there was some really funny talks um i had an absolute blast i'm so glad i was down there for that and able to participate um and hopefully next year i'll be able to um be on one of the teams there presenting that would be really cool Oh, they're getting into a fight. <laughs> oh, oh, she's losing. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh, no. Maybe she's winning. Oh, no. She lost. Okay. Sorry, Leah. Okay. Um, I know she's versus Camille. I'm, I'm almost positive she's versus Camille. And I know she's versus Jess. Um, we'll try Brayden again. Oh, he's, look, he's actually in something other than his workout wear. What is this? What are you doing, Brayden? Um, no. Uh, Vampiric Spa. Look at him. He's all dressed up. Where's he going? Where is he going? Stop flying away. What are you doing? Good. Have a spa, you two, and, and let her beat you, please. I don't feel like it. Oh, yeah, here they go. Ooh, you bar pursue him. I love how they say that. I think it's so cool. And we're sparring out the front of the house. <laughs> My. Oops. Getting into it. Oh, she's losing again. He's too strong for her. He's way too strong. Look at that. She's definitely losing. And down she goes. Brayden floats down and he'll help her up. Yeah, you tried. Yeah, she did. You know, I wonder if I should get him to challenge her. For the right to be head vampire. No, 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 no. Maybe, maybe in a few generations we might give that a shot. Um, so he wants to reach vampiric law level four and participate in vampire training. So I might get him to talk to Leah. I wonder if because they're on the same level. No, he's on the same rank or higher, so they can't. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, maybe I'll get Jess to get some training from Brayden. Oh, she's got a strange thirst. How low's her thirst? No, her thirst is okay. She's just struggling with being a vampire at the moment. Aren't you, Jess? Not super keen on it. So what I'll do is I'll get Brayden uh, more friendly. Oh, no, actually, it'll be under vampire. Oh. Jess needs to be in a better mood em oh, emotionally. Oh, well, okay then. Oh, there you go. She's happy now. So we'll go more vampire off of vampiric training. Hopefully that goes well. Come on, Brayden. He's flying off in bat form to get there. And he's there. Okay, come on. Offer us some training. We want to see Jess get some training and you level up a bit. Yeah, she seems like, she seems like yeah, okay, I guess so. I mean, maybe. I think he's in his dark form as well at the moment. Is he? They seem to be smiling at each other a lot. Which, I, I mean, I don't know. I'm more kind of gunning for her and Rain than her and Brayden. Oh, yeah, he's doing some training with her now. I might click on Leah as well while they're doing that just to see what we've got in the mail. So their, net, their house, like you can register as a vampiric lair and you'll get sent things from the vampire council. Um, so we'll just see if they've gotten sent anything like maybe some plasma packs or some plasma fruit, which I think they send as well. Oh, yep, yeah, Leah has collected everything from the mailbox. Thank you for registering your home with the vampire council. We hope you enjoy the complimentary gift for your participation. So we'll see what they got. What did she get? Looks like she got some plasma fruit, I think. Oh, it's green. Okay, well, she can have a drink of some plasma fruit. Um, Jess has got four points now. Um, so she can command garlic immunity, vampire creation, vampiric charm. I feel like she might have that just a bit. Or we can kind of cast hallucination. No, I'm going to go for vampiric charm, I reckon. Oh, and she has to take a weakness. Oh, a uh, guilty drinker. There we go. She wants to be a good vampire, so I feel like that suits. Oh, look, she's a minor vampire now. Okay, so that'll be why I had to take a weakness. Um, I'll get her back on the piano. Practice. Uh, might wake Amy up because Leah's getting a bit hungry. So we might compel for a deep drink or even possibly drain her 
Oh, nope, she's been drunk from recently. Okay, hang on, Amy. What you got? What you got going on? So we might just get Leah to have a drink from Amy, and we might just uh, leave it there after this. So I'll get Amy to drink a Moodlet Solver, and then get Leah to uh, have a nice big drink and maybe fill up some of her thirst. So you go, Jess is drinking that, and she'll feel a lot better now. Hang on, just got to wait for it to kick in. Yeah, it's kicked in. Okay, it should work now. Okay. That's all right. Jess is wandering off into the bathroom. Not Jess, Amy. <laughs> okay, uh, drink plasma. Compel for a deep drink. You're going to get drained. And then we might give her another mood let so she's okay. Oh, would you look at Brayden always working out. Seriously, I think we need to like put his name on a plaque and stick it on the wall. He lives there. Oh, we're walking, not bat forming or mist forming. I think she has got mist form. Uh, vampire. Oh, whoops. Vampire. Uh, dark meditation. Disable always move as mist. Maybe we'll go always move as bat. Alrighty guys, well thank you for joining me for this episode of The Sims 4 Vampire Family Challenge. I hope you'll join me again soon for the next episode where we might just try and go visit the other coven in San Myshuno. Wherever you are in the world, I hope that you're having a great time and I will see you soon.